Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 25th, okay? So, what do we have for right around the 25th? I cut it to justice in the nine of wands. So justice is the laws of karma, the laws of justice. You know, uh, karma has no toleration for lies and sees straight through uh, to a situation, sees the facts, sees the truth. I feel like we have somebody here that is dealing with some challenges. Uh, they may be growing weary wondering if you know justice is ever going to be served if they're ever going to get what they deserve you know there's there's also a lot of um, distrust i don't trust you know or disbelief or, or lack of faith faith in faith in humanity faith in justice being served um don't give up because some karma somebody's okay i had somebody say to me karma doesn't work both ways yes it does Yes, it does. If you think about the justice system, there's a loser and there's a winner. Okay, there's a plaintiff and there's a, and there's a defendant. And this is a card of karma. You can say whatever you want, but karma does definitely work both ways. We have a wounded individual here. It's like they're waiting, they're waiting, they're waiting. They're waiting to get what they deserve. So everybody get, is going to get what they deserve. This is, there's a fair and just decision that's being made, okay? There's no toleration for lies. There really isn't. Even if the legal system fails... You know, the, the, universe, the universe sees, the higher power sees. So I feel like there's going to be some, a realignment. I want to say realignment. You know, with that nine of wands, it's like I'm expecting it at any moment. You know, somebody's expecting, they've been wounded, they've had to, they've had to fight. And they're right to expect it because there's something coming. There's definitely something coming. Page of Pentacles. Now, Page of Pentacles, that's a golden opportunity. This is a new commitment. It's a new endeavor. It's a new project. So this is uh, setting new goals or finding focus again, refocusing, going down a new path, getting focus, right? This is using common sense. Um, so we have a new investment here. Somebody is going to be investing. It's like, it's a new opportunity. So somebody, this is taking a new opportunity. Somebody may be getting one. This is like a messenger that is giving somebody an opportunity to go down a path, okay? A path to security, a path to stability, but it's going to be hard work. So there's definitely hard work ahead. Somebody is going to be getting an opportunity. Okay? They are going to be getting an opportunity. This is a golden opportunity, but it's not going to be easy. Choice is always yours, whether you want to take it or not. Six of Wands reversed. So the Six of Wands reversed is a fail, right? This is a loser. This is somebody that is fighting some sort of battle. You know, they haven't won the battle. They're still fighting a battle or they're still playing games. Oh my goodness gracious. We got somebody here that's still playing games that is highly, highly, highly competitive. You know, that is still fighting somebody's still fighting they're still fighting you know they should be going in a new direction but they won't they won't it's like they like to play games maybe they're fighting commitment fighting stability you know sometimes we get people that that play games for so long you think about that nine of wands been doing it for a long time okay somebody's been avoiding challenge you know, they've been protecting themselves, got this barrier up around them. You know, so we probably do have a player here. We definitely do have a player here who is uh, 
struggling with an opportunity. I feel like it's a struggle with that six of wands reverse. This is a player. You know, if you go down a, a path to stability, you can't. There's no games involved. There's hard work. It's commitment involved. So it's about committing to this new endeavor, this new enterprise, this new project, this new prospect, whatever it is. But we have somebody here that, <laughs> I don't know, maybe they're a one-hit wonder, you know, the Six of Wands reverse. That's somebody that is very egotistical, that loves all the attention that they get, even if they get it, you know, they get it from multiple people. You know, it's like a one night stander, you know, somebody just goes around from one to the other, 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 you know, it, and that's the life they've been living. But it looks like somebody has a golden opportunity for stability, but they'll have to refocus, you know, and commit to it. And if this isn't, it, this could, this has to do with somebody that is losing, you know, they're losing uh, record, they're use, losing respect, they're losing rec support, they're losing recognition, people aren't respecting them anymore because they've been uh, playing games. They're not, they're not, they're losing support. So we have somebody here that is losing support, you know, um, because people are now starting to see, they're starting to see this person's character. Eight of Cups reversed. Thinking about it, thinking about a new opportunity, thinking a lot. Pretending to be happy with the Eight of Cups reversed and wanting to move on, you know, uh, it's like there's a lot of disappointment here, but staying put, playing it safe, avoiding change because of the work that it will entail. So somebody's definitely thinking about going down, going through this new door, going down this new path, but they're reluctant to uh, move on. Maybe this person is a coward. They could be definitely be a coward with a six of wands reversed. Maybe they don't have any confidence. You know, they don't, maybe they don't feel like they're adequate or they just don't want to stop playing, you know? Ooh, page of wands. Page of wands is good news, an offer or an invite. So there could be, definitely be a message that is coming with these two pages. You know, somebody's going to be receiving a message that excites them. They probably have an exciting opportunity right in the palm of their hands. Um, but there's negative thinking and there's negative self-talk. I feel like we have somebody here that needs to uh, think positive. They need to be uh, willing to go in a new direction and explore new avenues. So I feel like we have somebody here that needs something new. Um, and they need to really follow through. I feel like we have somebody here that is acting kind of childish. They may be acting immature with these pages. It's like it's time to grow up and stop playing games. And you can be, what, 48 or 50 or 60 even and still be a player, okay? So it's time to stop playing games. It's time to grow up, you know? So I think there's an alteration that is needed. Somebody is, wants to, it's like they want to go in a different direction. They're very disappointed in their current circumstances. They've been pretending, you know, that everything's okay where they're at. There could be a rejection here with that Six of Wands reverse. Somebody may have been rejected. There could be an apology that is coming with the Eight of Cups reverse. Somebody may be apologizing. They may want to come back. They may realize, they may be realizing something. You know, they may get some sort of reality check with that Page of Pentacles. That, you know, that's, a, that's an Ace of Pentacles. This is a golden opportunity for stability, for commitment. This is, there's, there's some sort of desire and attraction to it as well with the Page of Wands. So I think that somebody may be getting an apology. Somebody may be wanting to come back around. Maybe they gave up. They gave up because they were avoiding challenge or they thought they still wanted to play games, you know. Um, or they were battling, they were battling with, uh, with themselves. 
somebody was dealing with some inner conflict as well as to what path they wanted to go down. Because it's so much work, you know, it is work. It's work to start over. You know, it might be easier just to be that one that jumps, 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 than, uh, you know, commit to something and put in all the effort and invest in something solid, you know. I do feel like we have somebody here that is wounded and they are in the process of making a decision right now, the Nine of Wands and the Justice card as well. That's making a decision based on the facts, based on the truth. We have somebody here that, I don't know if they, I feel like they were rejected or they were let down. Now they're making it, and it could be, a, this could have to do with a legal contract, so maybe somebody has been tied to a contract. We definitely have a player here who's been playing games, no doubt about it. And we have a loss with the Six of Wands reverse. Somebody has lost. They've lost something. They failed to achieve. They failed to win at whatever it is that they were fighting for. And I feel like they failed to achieve it because they were, they didn't put in enough effort or they were, uh, had a big ego or they were, Lacking confidence, they weren't ready. They weren't ready to commit. They weren't ready to commit to the to to whatever it was. I feel like somebody has received unwelcome news, which caused them to think about their decisions. And I feel like we have a person that has has reached a point where, you know, they were about to give up. They were about to give up on something because they didn't want to put in the work. But maybe, maybe they're going to take it with the Page of Pentacles and the Page of Wands now. This is like refocusing, uh, coming back around. So somebody could be coming back around. I don't know. That Eight of Cups reverse. Definitely thinking about it. Disappointed. Emotionally disappointed. There could definitely be an apology here. Somebody is... Uh, I feel like they're really thinking. They're really, really thinking. Knight of Pentacles reversed. Could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. The world. The world is a major completion. Lesson learned. Saying goodbye to the past. Definitely making a choice with that justice card that we saw. Uh, we have some. So we have somebody here that. Um, hasn't been very practical. Maybe they didn't want responsibility. Unstable. Emotionally unstable. Insecure. Maybe even insecure with themselves. Lazy. Stubborn. But the world card is, is the end. Okay, this is somebody that's totally saying goodbye. Stepping into the future, saying goodbye to an unstable situation where they're not receiving anything in return. They've been staying put. They've been staying put for <clears throat> unrealistic reasons. They've been dealing with somebody who hasn't been giving them anything and they have two choices. There's definitely two options here. So somebody has two choices and they're making their choice. They're making their choice. But anyway, the Knight of Pentacles reverse is not practical. Somebody, ha they, or, or they haven't been receiving anything. They've been dealing with, I don't know if it's an ex-partner or it's somebody that ha doesn't have any money that has been using emotions against them next to the Eight of Cups. Somebody, somebody could be dealing with an individual that is emotionally unstable, that doesn't have any money, 
that cries and whines and gets them to give them money because they can't take care of themselves and it's causing di some sort of dysfunction We do have somebody here that wants to leave a situation. They are going to be ending something. This, I don't know if it has to do with a contract with the justice card. Somebody is maybe receiving news, you know, they maybe, maybe there's some sort of court, has something to do with court or filings or something like that. I, I feel like we have somebody here that is making a big decision they're ending something, you know, this is the end, it's the end, it's the end, it's, this isn't, this isn't stable, it's not, it's not giving me anything, it's not, it's not giving me anything. Taking a new opportunity, so goodbye. I mean, the world card is freedom. It's freedom. It's the end. It's somebody saying goodbye to the past. It really is. It's like I'm stepping out. I'm stepping out. I'm I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. It's it's over. It's over. Five of Swords. Five of Swords is admitting defeat. It's being defeated, right? pushing somebody away, pushing somebody away, going in a new direction. I, I gotta do, I gotta do what's right for me. I feel, I feel like that's what we have here. I feel like we have somebody here that's, that's, that's pushing somebody away. They're taking action because they're in a situation where they're not receiving anything. They're not getting anything in return. That's what I see. Five of Swords, that's hostilities, it is. It's fighting, it's power struggles, it's wanting, wanting. somebody wants to get their own way. They don't care who they hurt as long as they get what they want. This is somebody that is a sponger. I mean, the Knight of Pentacles reverse is a sponger. Somebody doesn't have any money, you know, they don't work, they don't want to put in any effort. They just want to get what they can get. Very lazy. So we have a lazy individual. I feel like this person has been, has no moral conscience. And I feel like this person has been keeping somebody, you know, playing with somebody, playing games, playing games with money games. It's almost like instead of the hunger game, well, maybe it is to keep them fed. But anyhow, it's the money games. It's like, I'm going to get as much money out of you as I can get. I don't care who I hurt as long as I, you keep giving it to me. This is some sort of sponger that has been using somebody just for their money. But I feel like we have an individual that is has been contemplating, you know, and it's like they're seeing it. It's like they're they're seeing it, you know. Anyhow, the world card is is right in the future. That is the end. It's the end of a it's the end of a project. It's the end of a phase. It's, it's the end of something big. It could be the end of a marriage, the end of a contract, the end of a uh, career. The it could be a graduation. It's something big that really affected your life. You know, so something is coming to an end that really taught you some sort of life lesson. So a lesson has been learned, it's over, it's time. It's time to say goodbye. So it really is time to say goodbye. With that eight of cups there, it's time to say goodbye. So somebody may be hearing those words, you know, it's time to say goodbye. You know, there could definitely be a fight, there could be a conversation. You know, we could have two people that are having a conversation. Uh, somebody says, you know, this really isn't making me happy, you're not giving me what I want. You know, or you're not giving me what I, you're not giving me anything. You're not, what are you, what are you giving me? You're not giving me anything. The Knight of Pentacles reverse, there's nothing solid here. There's nothing stable. There's not any love here at all. None. I mean, there could be financial gain. There could even be some sex. I don't know, but there ain't no love. Um, there isn't.
So anyhow, the world card is the end. It's the end of a journey. It's the end of that lesson. Lesson learned, major accomplishment. We have deep thought. Somebody's giving deep, deep, deep thought to a relationship. They are. And I feel like they know that they're dealing with somebody that doesn't have good intentions. They know it. But it, and it's hard to let go because whoever they're dealing with plays Six of Wands reversed, mirroring the Eight of Cups. Eight of Cups reversed, emotions. This person plays on their emotions. And when you're dealing with somebody that, you know, is very generous, then, you know, you are able to play on this person's emotions. They're able to be played. Somebody has been played. They have been played. Anyhow, I do believe that we have an individual that is uh, refocusing. You know, they're they're coming back around. It's like the, the the page of Pentacles is using common sense. It's it's getting practical. It's getting real. It's stabilizing. You know, and so anyway. And then we had the Justice, which was seeing the truth. So I feel like we have somebody here that is starting to see the truth. They do see the truth. It's like they know the truth. And this is a difficult decision. And there is a winner and a loser. Interesting that I started out like that. Six of Wands is win or lose as well, upright or reversed. There is a winner and there is a loser. And there is two choices here. We have a page of Pentacles and we have a page of Wands. So we have two people here. There's two choices. So, you know, but you have to walk away from the Eight of Cups reversed from the unstable situation that, where you're not getting anything, whether this is a job or it's a partnership or whatever it is. And the Five of, Cups, Five of Swords is walking away, okay? It's admitting defeat, right? It's walking away from this situation, right? It's like it's non-negotiable. This is non-negotiable. Goodbye. Goodbye. That's what I hear. It's like goodbye. Don't come back. And maybe, maybe it's caused a fight. You know, maybe there's been a fight with the other option. I don't know, with the two pages here. Because the Five of Swords is a fight. And we have, we have three people here. It feels like there's a third party situation. This could have to do with children. Could have to do with children. I don't know. Seeing very, very clearly what the best choice is. So somebody has been exploring their options. Now it's reverse. It's better in reverse as far as I'm concerned because this is becoming clear of a choice. There's been confusion. Somebody had multiple options. They didn't know what to choose. They were confused. Now they see clearly. This is making the choice. So somebody is making a choice. They're going to stop. They're going to stop uh, letting this person abuse them. Somebody has been abused with the Five of Swords. They've been abused. I feel like there's financial abuse, abuse and there's emotional abuse. It's in the Knight of Pentacles is stop. It's like stop. I see very clearly. Just stop. Just stop. Three of Pentacles reverse, not working together. No, lack of teamwork, lack of togetherness, lack of respect. Not on the same page. We have a relationship, and it's a, there is a third party situation here. We have a relationship that is not on the same page. I don't know if it's a work partnership or it's a or it's a love relationship or whatever it is. There's another player. Okay, there's too many people involved. Three is a crowd. The end. This isn't working out. Under the world with the three of pentacles reversed underneath it. This is the end. This isn't working out. There's no togetherness. There's no teamwork. We can't work together. We can't all do this together. It's not going to work out. I got. I can't have it all. You know. I got. I got. I got to choose one option. Yeah. I can't have. You can't have your cake and eat it too. Well, you can, but. Anyhow. Three of Pentacles reversed. It's not a relationship not on the same page. There's another person that, that don't, they don't get along. It's, it's not working out. So I, this something is happening. Somebody is seeing very, very clearly what the best choice is. Somebody is going to be told. I feel like they're going to be told to leave, or they're you know they're forced to leave. You know, 
something about this is non-negotiable you know this is non-negotiable this person keeps on coming back it's like they leave and they come back they leave and they come back they leave and they, this is a player you can't no no with the with the knight of pentacles reverse no it's over we're not going to play this game anymore we're not going to play this game anymore no anyhow page of pentacles is taking a new opportunity there's a new prospect here um refocusing getting grounded being practical focusing on the future with the world card saying goodbye to the past saying goodbye to the sponger or the underqualified individual that doesn't have anything to offer you know saying goodbye to that it's like no you know I'm not sorry and I'm not even sure if there is a sorry here I don't think there is anyhow we have the eight of wands that is uh, fast forward movement somebody is ready they're ready to move forward devil devil so the devil is a bond right it's a toxic bond it's an unhealthy bond it's a sexual bond okay so somebody is bound to a situation okay uh, there's ties that are going to be severed going right on top of that five of swords that is severing ties Severing ties with a toxic, unhealthy bond. Going down a new path. Now that bond could be an addiction. Okay? Could be an obsession. Could be a person. It's, a, it's slavery. Okay? It's breaking free. It's breaking the chains. It's severing ties. Somebody is severing ties. They are. They have a strong desire for something more, for something stable, for something solid. They do. There's, I just cut it. Eight of Wands again. This is movement. Increased speed. Things speeding up. Things changing fast. A message is coming. It could be it could be an apology. Somebody may be coming back around that left, and maybe they they made a poor choice with that seven of cups that with the third party. I don't know what's going on, but they're they may be maybe they took some time to think about it. There's also somebody here that is saying goodbye to the toxic bond, right? It's like they were thinking about it. <laughs> that's what it is. They were thinking about the eight of cups reverse. That's thinking about it, thinking about it, thinking about it, thinking about going down this new path. Yeah. That's what I'm doing. I mean, that's what, well, I don't know who's doing it, but anyhow, Ace of Cups, new start in love. This is a new start in love. This is, this is, this could even be a reunion. Okay. This is an, it could be a new love. Okay. Expression of feelings, flood of emotion. Following the heart. There is communication coming. I had the Ace of Swords on the bottom a while ago. I don't know if I showed it or if you saw it. So there is a wake-up call. Somebody's going through an awakening. They're going to be communicating. I feel like they... Uh, maybe they were fearful with that Nine of Wands. You know, they were they were thinking about giving up. Maybe because they just... They, they, maybe they still wanted to play. Anyhow, I do believe that there's there's a major completion here of a cycle. Somebody's going to be severing ties with somebody that they don't work well with. They're choosing another option. And it's non-negotiable. Good luck.